Good morning. I think we're good. When you guys hop on, say good morning. Let me know where you guys are tuning in from. All right, so I'm gonna make this iced coffee I used to make um, a long time ago, actually. I made it and I just started kind of getting back into the iced coffee situation because it's summer and who doesn't want iced coffee, right? So I'm going to show you guys on live exactly how I make my iced coffee and I think I've perfected it because um, I absolutely love it and I don't have to add any additional like sweeteners or anything like that. Um, there is probably like one thing that you guys could tweak because obviously part of this that I'm going to show you is probably not something that you want to eat every single day um but the iced coffee portion you can have that every day literally i have it every day um that's kind of what i've been drinking lately to be honest um so first things first i have my clear glass um and i'm actually tweaking it up a little bit today so we're gonna see how it tastes so i always shake my tub all right and then so i'm gonna get about three quarters scoop of my coffee tub and wow I got a little too excited I swear I'm always making a mess on here you guys so I always shake my tub because um, it sometimes settles and you don't like that so I do about three quarters of a scoop Okay. Um, but like I said, I always shake my tub beforehand because you don't want everything to settle at the bottom. All right. I made a mess already. Hello, hello, good morning. Right. I'm not <laughs> wasting this coffee. So. Right. so I put about a three quarter scoop of the coffee okay um so how am i switching it up i'm switching it up because i'm gonna add a little bit of chai in there vanilla chai um because i recently um added it a couple days ago in my iced coffee and i really really like it so shake your tub shake your tub um so now i'm gonna take the chai and i'm gonna take about a little bit less than like half a scoop um not a lot so about that much like that okay and put that in there so i'm doing that first and what i'm gonna do is um so now i'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of salt you're probably asking why am i adding salt um, and specifically sea salt or if you have Himalayan pink salt. Um, so this is going to help balance out the coffee, but it's also going to help balance out the sweetness from chai. Now chai doesn't have any sugar in it. Um, it is sugar free actually. Um, there's only like two, three grams of carbs. It's only 25 calories um, and there's no sugar. So the salt is going to help counteract the sweetness um, from the chai. Some people um, don't like the sweetness of chai. Some people don't like the sweetness of um, any of like the stevia and things like that. So salt is going to help counteract that in a lot of things, um, not just your drinks. But this is just a little tip for you guys. Add salt to your things and it's going to really counteract that. So I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit in there. Okay. So um, the first step is I'm going to put some water in here. Um, 
probably about this much. Um, and then you need a frother. Frother is freaking amazing. So I'm going to blend that and make sure that it blends really well. So I do that first because it's a powder and I, I want to mix this really well um, before adding any of the cold products in it. fill it up all the way because half of this ice is probably gonna melt when you put the liquid in anyways um, so I'm gonna add a little bit of more water right about, so about this much um, I should have I, I normally like scale it out but I never did so I'm gonna pour that in here So now that we got that going, okay. Um, next thing is, um, this stuff is freaking amazing and I only use a little bit um, because again, it's concentrate and you don't need a lot, but the flavor is freaking amazing when you mix it with your coffee. So yeah, this is cold brew vanilla. Um, like I said, only a little bit because I already have some coffee in here. Um, if I find a decaf cold brew, I'll let you guys know but I'm only putting about a quarter, maybe even less than that. Right. So I'm only doing a quarter cup of the iced coffee. Okay, there we go, perfect, see? That's it. And I probably put a little too much of water the first time, but that's fine. Um, okay. So now I have unsweetened coconut milk. So I'm going to pour a little bit of that. Okay. And then I'm going to put a tablespoon of um, creamer. Not a lot, but this is coconut sweet cream. So I'm going to put like a tablespoon. could leave it like this and that's what I usually do and drink it every day um, but today's Saturday um, and I want to get creative so I'm gonna sip a little bit about this first All right. so I sipped a little bit of that now here's the fun part so this is cold brew ice cream by So Delicious, dairy free, it's vegan friendly, all that good stuff. Um, and it's made with coconut milk. So I'm gonna take this. And then where's my spoon? So I'm gonna put a few tablespoons of this right on the top. Since I don't have whipped cream, that's why I'm gonna do that. No. The freaking idiot hunt is the one who told me to get it. Yeah, not me. Don't blame me. Alright, so I put the ice cream and then I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of cinnamon. I honestly should have put the cinnamon first, um, but it's okay. We forget things. And that's it. You get a freaking sweet treat. You're still gonna get 
the mental clarity. You're still going to get the energy. You're going to still get the amazing appetite suppressant. Um, your coffee doesn't have to be boring, basically, is what I'm trying to tell you guys. It's really, really good. And if y'all haven't had... Um, you can have it. Yeah, I'm done with that. Um, what was I saying? I forgot. <laughs> um... Yeah, I don't know. I forgot, guys. Um, but yeah, you're still going to get all the amazing benefits from the coffee regardless. And it doesn't have to be um, boring at all. So yeah, this is my favorite. Oh, that's what I was going to say. If you guys haven't had cold brew ice cream before, you're missing out. I have probably about three different tubs at home. Um, different, like different brands at different times. Um, so this one's by So Delicious and it's just cold brew coffee um i have another one that's by another brand and it's cold brew coffee as well but with like a salted caramel like cookie blend or something like that so if you guys are interested in that i will post pictures of it later down below if you want but go ahead and enjoy your coffee um and um i hope you guys have a fabulous saturday and enjoyed the recipe. So, thank you for everyone who tuned in. Um, if you have any questions about the thing that I made, let me know, and I will answer it for you guys. And yeah, so have an amazing day, and I'll talk to you guys later.